Can I ask you some, something about your music? Mm. Um, what, what are the main musical influences uh, in, that we hear? In, um... <coughs> well, I've always been a fan from my teens, really, of American music, particularly jazz. And so um, when Tony Papano was talking about that, it was something that I'd never really incorporated. There's a little bit in my first opera, Greek. Um, there's a bit of Charles Mingus, I suppose, influence. Um, and, and, I, and certainly Silver Tassi was almost none. So I'd never really... Uh, and in fact, I've never really worked with jazz players in the, in the orchestra, so I knew that I wanted a, a certain amount of the jazz-tinged music. And, um, and I remember when we were talking about uh, the size of orchestra, actually, which is quite key, because I remember seeing, funny, if we talk about Bert Russell's Minor Tour, which was just before, I think it was a commission before, um, uh, the one, one before, before, yeah. uh, before Anna Nicole, um, I'd seen quite a lot of the orchestra overspilling into the into the boxes and stuff, which is fine. But I I was determined that wasn't going to happen. I was going to use a Puccini size orchestra with with a jazz trio, and, and, and there's two saxes as well, which is the only extra thing. So, but I also um, I I think I asked for Pete Erskine, this great drummer that I'd worked with um, on many occasions, because I felt that it, he would drive the certainly the, the sort of the more jazzy elements, he would be just perfect for it. And I think that that, that was agreed and that was one of the things I really wanted to do. So I knew I had certain key people um, on board. And, um, and as I said, that because, because American music is um, so close to me, in, in a sense, and has been for a long time, that, 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 that in a way, um, it was quite a joy to work in, you know. I mean, I, I, I didn't know so much about Broadway and, and I think there are, there are certain things that are connected with musicals, partly also because of the way that Richard writes, so I knew that was there, although I know less about it. But I, I knew that, that um, there, was, there was some jazz element would, would be part of it, so that was a key thing. Although, you know, I wasn't working with um, Broadway singers or jazz singers, it was going to be with, you know, operatic singers, but I was trying to make it sort of seamless and not like, oh, this is a now a, you know, jazz bit and this is now a mm. operatic. So I was trying to make the whole thing a bit of a blend. Mm. So that's what I tried to do. And, 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 and in many ways, that was a lot of fun. Mm. 